When you enter the memorial room at the British Columbia Aviation Museum, go to the back left-hand corner. You will find a display honoring the Hawker Hurricane and the woman who was the chief aeronautical engineer at the Canadian Car and Foundry Company in Fort William, Ontario. Elizabeth Gregory McGill, who was known as Elsie, was born in 1905 in Vancouver. In 1927, she graduated from the University of Toronto, the first Canadian woman with a degree in electrical engineering. In 1929, she completed her master's from the University of Michigan, the first woman in North America with a degree in aeronautical engineering. From 1938 to 43, she oversaw the building of more than 1,400 Canadian-built hurricanes at the Canadian Car and Foundry Company. Elsie McGill designed a winter version with skis and de-icing equipment, creating the first high-speed aircraft for winter conditions. She became known as the Queen of the Hurricanes. Eighteen Canadian squadrons were equipped with hurricanes. Three of them were here at Patricia Bay. This Sea Hurricane Mark 1B is another unique aircraft. Built in Canada in 1940, it eventually ended up at the Shuttleworth Collection in 1961. Hurricanes were the first RAF fighters to carry out sweeps over Europe in 1941. Hurricanes were the first bomb-carrying RAF fighters and pioneered the use of rocket projectiles for ground attack. In the African desert, Hurricanes were equipped with twin 40 mm cannons in a tank busting role. Hurricanes carried the brunt of the war in Malta, the desert and Burma until they could be replaced by Spitfires. She last flew more than half a century ago. Today, after a restoration project which took 10 years and cost over a quarter of a million pounds, the world's last surviving sea hurricane was ready to fly again. The aircraft earned its place in history as the first ship-borne single-wing fighter. Perhaps its most glorious moment, the relief of Malta in 1942 and it was the direct predecessor to today's high-tech carrier jets. The Hawker Hurricane was originally designed by Sidney Cam. In 1937, it was the first RAF modern fighter. It was armed with eight 303 caliber machine guns. Fabric covered this single seat monoplane with an enclosed cockpit, an oxygen system, and retractable landing gear. It could achieve a speed of 340 miles per hour and climb to 36,000 feet. In the Battle of Britain, hurricanes downed more enemy aircraft than all RAF aircraft and ground defenses combined including the Spitfires. On the back wall, you will find a limited edition Wilkinson sword commissioned to mark the Hawker Hurricane's 50th anniversary. Inscribed on the blade are all the Second World War campaigns in which the hurricane took part. Visit the display dedicated to the Hawker Hurricane and all the others at the British Columbia Aviation Museum at YYJ.